the documentary aired on Channel TV Sunday night. Hmm. President Mohamed Buhari revealed that his first two children died as a result of sickle cell disease. He revealed that he became aware of the disease after he got married and later found out that his late wife was AS. Can you imagine? Hmm. That's it to tell you that uh, a lot of people are really educated illiterate at that level because you can't tell me that he didn't go to school. Somebody who has been going abroad and all of that at that level, he didn't know. We still have a lot of people who are in that category. Of course, some people deliberately go into such marriage. You know, faith in it. Oh, God will do it. God will whatever. But at the end of the day, they will not be able to cope. He added that his first son and daughter were SS and they died. However, he further stated that he made sure his second wife was AA before he got married to her. Speaking further, he revealed that SS is not acceptable to him, which was why he went for AA. According to him, there was there's what we call sickle cell anemia. There are people who are S A and there are a few who are SS who are AS and SS. So I think that when the developed country found out about the sickle cell disease, they tried to stop marriage between AS and SS so that they wouldn't have this sickle cell anemia. My late wife, my late first wife, unfortunately was S A S. S A or A S and I am A S. So my two children, my first daughter and my first son, happen to be S S and they died of it. But when I went when I went for my second wife, I told the person who introduced her to me that she must be A A. So if my child picks S from me, then he will also pick A from her. <laughs> oh my god, see what's in person the young. Well, it will encourage a lot of people because at this age and time, some people are still falling into the same nonsense, telling us that they love oh because oh God will do it and what have you. Your late wife was AS, same as you are. How come that your two kids were SS? One should be AS and the other should be AS. Like, like president, you can't fool everybody at the same time. No, it is right. Unless that means you too, you don't even understand how it how it works. You are the one who is even ignorant. You don't know what you are saying. Can AS and AS marry? Knowledge is powerful. Kudos to Mr. President for this advice. A big lesson from him here. He says this as he sees. That is why I said you are not educated. You're supposed to know this during that time. Can you imagine? Even if you don't like the president, must you insult him? You don't need to insult him. But all I know is that he's supposed to have known that at that level because he was not a novice. Somebody who has been going abroad for more than what is it called? 40 years. He tells us that he does a, his medical check or he has his doctor over there. Well, keep quiet and stop fooling yourself. Now, what's in the rights give our president? Now, in the read, I beg, make nobody blame him. We all know how he they go. I be it easy for anybody to act like a president. Good money. Having noticed this, have you been able to pay a program, especially for the Muslim community, to explain more about this before marriage? Most of them are not subjected to testing their genotypes or hiv status before marriage there's a lot of marriages there but no test is carried out teach them and encourage them to go to school tell them the truth so that their own children will be like your own that are very educated it is so unfortunate that the nuns are still roaming the streets begging for food and that is a very valid point here now what and what has he done since that time he has not even come out to say let me educate people we have a lot of them who are just jamming each other he did not say his only election time they will just come out in an open roof uh, car they will be waving hands and people will just plenty they will have... that is it what and what have you said what and what um program have you 
put in place for your people to benefit. Like I said, a lot of people are still in that category as we speak today. Hmm. I beg shift. Why lecturing us on this issue now? This is diversion of interest. By the way, he should not be the one to deliver this lecture. We are in critical situation and condition and is there telling us about his family that never existed jubilee family or diseased buhari family and you are going to hand over to ee Achiku abubaka <laughs> okay thanks for the information this is wisdom to avoid giving birth to children that will be suffering every now and then we should be we should not be blinded with love unless you can pay through for god's miracle yes god can do it I open up for everyone. Nice work, President Buhari. Mr. President has spoken well. So you want to tell me that uh, some people are not aware of this? Hmm. Okay. Oh. You want people to learn from his past mistake that cost him two children. There's nothing like love is blind. Suit us. Please take notes of this when you are choosing partner. No wonder he don't tea with this man harding up. Life don't show and pepe before so no be today live on show and pepe mm. and the question is as how many people have you been able to maybe okay some people will just quickly have a foundation to talk about this but does it do that no none of this has happened 